Have you ever shot a video using your camera and shoot some amazing footage and put it onto your computer, edit it nicely and put it onto YouTube only to notice that your video is very pixelated and blurry and all the details gone and your video is practically ruined? Well that is thanks to our great friend YouTube compression. YouTube has to compress your video so your computer and your internet connection can handle the playing the video. But if you're like me, you probably want to deliver your video the highest quality possible. So I came up with this theory. When you upload a full HD or 1080p video to YouTube, YouTube compresses it down to about 8 megabits per second. But if you upload a video in 4K or Ultra HD format, YouTube only compresses it down to about 35 to 45 megabits per second. So what if you shoot a video in 1080p full HD and upscale it to 4K format and upload to YouTube. Would that give you better image quality than uploading in 1080p? I knew that this theory is correct, but I had to do some testing to show you guys how much of a difference it actually makes. So I shot a video using my GH4 in MOV format, 29.97 frames per second. The bitrate was set to 200 megabits per second, the highest GH4 can handle and all the other camera setting details are written in the description below. I shot everything handheld so that uh, the footage will be very shaky and I emphasize the compression a lot more because there's a lot of changes between the frames. I exported the footage using Final Cut Pro 10, one in, and one in 4K Ultra HD and that, the other one in the 1440p which is also known as Quad HD and one in Full HD 1080p. I uploaded all three versions onto YouTube and downloaded all of them in several different resolutions. Now keep in mind that you don't actually need a 4K monitor to watch this video. You just want to watch it in 4K quality. This has very little to do with playback, but it has a lot to do with compression. Now if you really want to compare the shots, you can just hit the pause button and see the differences. Okay, so here are the results of the side-by-side -side comparisons I made. At a first glance, you might not notice any difference, but let's pause the video and take a closer look. The differences you might see in the highlights and mid-tones is pretty minor, but if you take a closer look at the shadows, you'll see a big difference. Just look at how much of the detail is lost in a 1080p version. In this frame, for example, it's a pretty noticeable difference. Next up, I wanted to compare the 1080p footage on the right side to the upscaled 4K and downscale again on YouTube as a 1080p and download it. The difference is not as significant, but you can still see that upscale and downscale again is actually not that great compared to just straight 1080p upload to 1080 download. On the left side, we have an upscaled 4K and uploaded, and download in 4K. The shot on the right side is straight out of the camera, and there's no compression. You also have to keep in mind that if you're watching this on YouTube, the footage has been compressed, and on the left side, it's been compressed twice because it's been uploaded, downloaded, and uploaded again. This time, we're comparing the Upload at 1080 and download 1080, no upscaling versus as shot straight out of the camera shot. You can notice a big difference in compression. The left side is quite a bit blurry and pixelated, and you can see a lot of compression artifacts. These two shots are from the same video, upscaled 4K but download in two different resolutions. The left side is 1440p or Quad HD and right side is 4K UHD. Both the image qualities are pretty similar but you can see the 4K one is slightly sharper and you can see more, a lot more details. The left side has been upscaled to 4K and uploaded and downscaled by, by YouTube and downloaded as a 1440p. The right side has been upscaled to 1440p Quad HD and uploaded and downloaded the same resolution. Again, the qualities are pretty similar, 
but on the right side, the, the, the one without downscaling is a little slightly sharper and you see more details in the shadow. So finally, I want to show you guys to see the difference between a 1080p footage with no upscaling, compressed by YouTube, of course, and the middle one, which is 4K, upscaled 4K and downloaded as 4K, and the right shot is straight out of the camera, no compression. Now, of course, keep in mind again that uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, the footage is compressed, and the middle ones and the left one are compressed twice. Hope you guys see the difference I'm seeing. And if you don't see any difference, then your your vision might be below 20, 80 or something, and you might want to consider having your eyes checked. And I hope this video was helpful to you guys, and I hope that you guys will keep making amazing videos and upload them to YouTube so I can watch them. And until next time. Oh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel.